navigate Google Classroom. You can get to Google Classroom from the app panel on any Google screen. When you get here, you'll notice all the classes that you're enrolled in. Your teacher may have added you, or you may join from the plus sign in the top right by entering a code provided by your teacher. Once you have all of your classes here, you'll get a nice snapshot of all of the upcoming work. So all the work that's due for the next six days will show up in the tile of the class. When you open the class, you'll see any important announcements right here on the stream. So this is your stream tab, and here are all of your important announcements. On the left, you'll also notice your upcoming work. Your teacher may enable this Meet Now link. If they are scheduling a Google Meet with the class, you can click on this Meet to join your teacher's meeting. Your teacher might have an alternative method of doing virtual meetings, but this might be the method that they use and this is where you'd find the link. So the stream is where you find the Meet link, your upcoming assignments, and any important announcements. The next section is your classwork section. These blue things are called topics. Your teacher might sort their materials or questions or assignments by topic. The topic might be a unit name or it might be the date and all the associated assignments for that date. You'll, you can sort by topic by clicking on a topic and only the assignments with that topic will show up. But by default, it says all topics. Here's another way to get to the meeting link. And this is a Google Calendar for this classroom that lists all of the work that it has an assigned due date. This link will lead to a folder in your Google Drive that has all of your work for this class. When you click on view your work, it will show you all of the work that you have been assigned as well as um, any grades or feedback would show up here as well, but I haven't turned anything in as in this class. Um, and when you click on these three lines again, you could go back to classes and see all of your classes. You can toggle between different classes by clicking a different class. You can see your archive classes from last year if you had anything you want to look back on. And then this is really useful. There's a to-do list listed right here, and it's also listed right here. And we'll show you all the work that you have to do this week and all the work that you have to do later. Here is your assigned work. Then it will show you any missing work that you haven't turned in. And if it was, um, if the due date passed, it will show up here as red because you are missing your work. And anything that you've completed will show up under done. So this to-do list, either here or here will help keep you on track to make sure you get all your work done. And that is a tour of Google Classroom.